Oh, good. You're here. In this video, I'm going to be guiding you through how to complete what many people call the hardest elite challenge to attain, the Doomsday Heist Act 3, the Doomsday Scenario, with only two players. You could do this with three or four players, as the tactics used in this guide will still be the same. The first thing you need to do is fully stock up on snacks and armor. Facility location isn't paramount as the timer doesn't start straight away, but the closest one is this one here at Sandy Shores. Before you start, invite all players to a CEO organization as this will benefit you during a heist as it will refill your health bar for free. The timer for the elite challenge will start as soon as a player gets close enough to despawn the yellow dot. <laughs> Either vehicle to choose from here is fine, but if you want speed, then take the barrage, with the passenger in the front seat. The Kanjali tank will mean getting deep into Avon's facility without taking any damage, but it will add a good few minutes onto your time. If you took the barrage, you'll be at the tunnel cutscene in about 2 minutes 20. If you took the Kanjali, it'll be 3 minutes 50. With the barrage, as soon as you can, bring up your interactions menu and your armor, just in case you get shot along the way. Go, go, that's where you want to be. 50 years old. There is an optimal route here which is sticking to the left past the first insurgent and dodging to the right of the second. The player in the passenger seat can auto aim with an AP pistol to start racking up the headshot count. When you get to the third insurgent, go around the back and do the same with the fourth. You'll now have three more insurgents heading straight for you, so take the side that is easiest to get through. The last insurgent has lightning reflexes for going forward and reversing, so be alert to not get trapped and battered. Pack up and prepare your miniguns for the four juggernauts. You gotta do the rest of this on foot. Now take cover quick. We got more of those super soldier things. At least we can see them this time. You find out the Your current time will be about 3 minutes 45. If you took the Kanjali, it'd be about 5 minutes 30. Make it over. You gotta do the rest on foot. Do not rush in on this next part as you'll barely last a few seconds. Just get the first guard on the right and be patient to wait for the others to pop their heads out before hitting them in the face. My weapon choice here is the special carbine Mark II for headshots, but choose whatever you're most comfortable with. It's important to not have weapons too OP as the soldiers may die before you get a chance to shoot their head. You must hit 150 headshots or you will fail the elite challenge. Two more guards at these doors. And now you're here to kill us. Then ready your miniguns for another juggernaut. Headshot the three or four more enemies down the hallway, then it's time to split up. Now find another box. The player taking the right side will have three crates to destroy and multiple enemies. Remember to take out the supplies. Any one of these boxes could contain Clifford's coat. If we want to kill it and get paid, they've all got to go. It's all about learning where each soldier will spawn and hide and bagging those headshots. Five the attack. Alert, Mrs. R. Take out his supplies. Wipe out his supplies. Be sure to stop for snacks if need be. Do I have a five? No, Clifford. 
Lord. Just a daddy. It's for the best. By my calculations, the best thing we can do. Looks like you've cut off the supplies. Now go through the blast doors into the control center. We can't let them initiate the launch sequence. Avon, what does passive are? Head to the right to take out a few more. Once you've cleared this section, two juggernauts will spawn. I have of them. I like Daddy. Take them down and move! Were you hoping for more of those juggernauts? Because you're in luck. They just armed the missile system. Things just got a lot more serious. The main launch facility is through some big doors at the end of the tunnels. The player taking the left should quickly headshot the first soldier, or else he hides and shoots from cover. They've all got to go. Be sure to get the crate. Boxes, don't and then take care of the next three soldiers. Hit the nest. Let's clean them out of here. Come on. Bullets for the people, bombs for the stuff. You heard Mrs. R. Take out his supplies. If that AI is so... Then push on and take out the next few. Goons, liquidize them. You shoot and run, folks. I've seen it done a million times. Come on. Avon, where did you find these awful people? If you get soldiers hiding in cover, hit them a few times to knock them down and headshot them on their way back up. Looks like you've cut off the supplies. Now go through the blast doors into the control center. We can't let them initiate the launch sequence. Avon, what does passive aggressive mean? Be, be quiet for a minute. There is one other thing you need to be wary of, and that's the rapid fire bug. Occasionally, specifically in this heist, an enemy will empty a full clip into you within a fraction of a second and there's nothing you can do. You will die. Daddy, or sir, like in an old-fashioned room. I have read 4,000 of them. I like Daddy. Avon's been on a real recruitment drive, evidently. Big guy is dead! From this vantage point, you're safe from the Juggernaut's attacks, so minigun them both before headshotting the soldier hiding down to the left. Both players will now meet up to take out the last four. I can hack anything. I can even hack my way into myself. I can watch myself think. I can, and I do. Artificial intelligence! <laughs> More like artificial dumbness! <laughs> LOL! Don't waste snacks here, as after the cutscene, both players' health will be fully restored. I hacked into that door. That door is shut. You'll not open that door. No, Clifford! Voila! <laughs> Your AI is vain and insecure. I wonder where he gets that from. Try and shoot the guard up top first. Clifford! Then kill the other soldiers from inside cover. Stop that missile! Come on! Launch protocol activated. 20 minutes. Exit out together and kill the guards on the right. Wow. and at least one more to the left. Get up there and stop that missile protocol! Then make your way diagonally to the set of stairs. If I'm getting my skin burned off in a nuclear... Run straight to the first server to start the hacking. Brash and annoying elected leader spikes the nuclear football in a fit of peak. Not some brash and annoying self-proclaimed AI god! I'm not CEO here, so the CEO will stay with me for about 20 seconds, which will regenerate me to full health, while he racks up more headshots. You've got a single board computer, plug it in. Clifford has the network jammed up, so the only override to launch will be the PDPC's hardware keys, which we don't have, but maybe we do. Plug in your machine. He'll then run across to the opposite corner for the second hack. We're through level one authentication. Start again on level two. Got a single board computer. 
Computer, plug it in. The hacking is pretty simple, but can be time consuming. You need to reconfigure the single board to match the key the system's looking for. All you need to do is reflect the laser to hit the blue packets. You should usually have this hack done within a minute. Make sure you're at full health when you exit the hack, as the animation is really slow and you will suffer some damage. With the other player hacking the second server, headshot some more soldiers, then wait for an opening before running to the third server to the right. I also like it's the Welsh concept of for If you think you may be lacking in the headshot department at this point, simply go slower on the hacking so the other player can kill more soldiers. The soldiers are basically infinite in this section, so take advantage. The CEO can then come round to the other player to again regenerate his health. I want to be a cat. I want to be a king. I will be king, Avon. I will be, and a carbon-based non-thinking machine will worship me like a god. Level 2 authentication passed. Now the next one. Next console, please. Look, look, all right. The missile's going to launch. That's a given. Then the retaliatory missile. When the third hack is about to be completed, run to the opposite corner for the fourth and final hack. Stay in cover and pop out for headshots. Remember, if you are lacking in headshots, have the hacker stalled to get as many as you need. When the fourth hack is completed, the soldiers will stop spawning. We're in! Missile launch protocol override! Yeah! Don't celebrate just yet! Avon's got men all over there! There's some Take out the last batch and head straight up the side stairs to the cloud servers. Hardware fucking override! The launch is off! Sir? The launch is only delayed, Avon. Soon I'll be controlling every system in every silo in the world. I won't need you then, Avon. As a two player, one player takes out B and C, the other takes out A first and then reset to take out D. What was that? They are killing me, Avon. Head down the stairs and then jump over the barrier to follow the yellow waypoint. They would have killed the Earth in a long and boring way. I only wanted to make it. To be a god. Several more headshot opportunities here. So many thoughts. Lost forever. Will you cry for me? I will miss you. Daddy. Make your way through the tunnels. It's a single path to the silo. We have to contain it. Do you know what you've done? He was smarter than you. He was better than you. Just keep pushing through, overlapping to give each other a chance to reload. Net, he was amazing. 
amazing, and you killed them. Well, you didn't kill all of them. I got the original code right here, and you're not getting it. Clifford will live again. Hurry up. What if he shares the code open source? There'll be dickhead AIs everywhere. Now he's too into IP for that. Anyway, stop him. Avon is on the run with the last Clifford drive around his neck. Get him. Only one player needs to make it to the waypoint to activate the last part of the mission. Stop Progress, you fools! I'm the future! I'm a tidal wave of tsunamis! I cannot be stopped! Clifford cannot be stopped! <laughs> Get in those silly jetpacks and chase that little snot! This is it! Take him out! Take him out! If Avon can fly a jetpack, anyone can! After him! Missiles are standard on government jetpacks. Put them to use! Ignore all the helicopters and head straight for Avon. And that stupid AI around his neck! This is about money and job satisfaction now! Get him! Shoot him out of the sky! Blast! 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 Lock on, shoot a couple of missiles, then head to the observatory. Elite Challenge completed in 19 minutes and 24 seconds with 155 headshots. Afterwards, depending on what vehicle you took, the host will get either a 50k bonus for selling the Barrage or a 100k bonus for selling the Kanjali. So if you found this video useful, please drop it a like and maybe consider subscribing for more. Oh, shut up! I'm Beatsdown. This was all my master plan and uh, I should get a promotion. And I'll see you in the next one. It's gonna be like you never existed.